So, um, ILEs, right? Let's talk about fucking ILEs. A little shout out to different individuals. Habibi, Spin, those are the ILEs. And Anima, who people think he's an ILE, some people don't think he's an ILE. Who the fuck knows, but he's a cool guy. So let's get in on it. So, any base. They're very uh, big picture oriented individuals who are very bored by mundane and repetitive tasks okay everything that they do they want to create new things um there's almost this innovative edge to them kind of take a concept and be able to expand on it see the inter uh, interconnections between different concepts see the patterns between different concepts this is very they're very good at doing that the ileys i've known are very witty very creative in that sense when they insult you oh my fucking god it's funny it's funny because when I insult people, it's very, it's just crude and very straightforward. When they do that, man, they, the words they fucking use, dude, it's funny. So that's how it manifests. Very, very creative individuals in that sense, and many of them in the typology community can come up with different. They're they can they can read on a the type. They're not even that interested in fucking reading about type and just copying and pasting. They will make their own judgments. They'll make their own observations based on the patterns, and they'll create their own take on it which is going to be new. That's often a behavior I've seen from ILEs in the community. Now, um, let's get to... Uh, so, we obviously, right? It's easy. We know what the fuck that is. So, then we have TI Creative, and TI Creative is going to be more scientific than it would be with beta type. Uh, systematic, very logically consistent, and they're following a clear logical uh, pattern, okay, here. Focused on systems, so the TI is fo uh, feeds the NE, and this is clear. Whenever they're doing those kind of ideas, whenever they're creating the new systems or trying to innovate those things, have their own take on it, they um, they always have the TI helping them. That it is logically consistent. If if they explain to you the train of thought of the connections, you can track it. If you have TI, you can understand it. So they're very logically consistent individuals. They're logical people. Uh, so systematic, uh, logical, ordered, um, unlike betas who are also that in, in that way, their, bait, their, their TI is focused more on categorization of people and it's more social in a sense. And you can see it. It's kind of more obvious. And also about the NE, let's not forget since, you know, any base, they're very focused on different perspectives. So quite logical people who, who are able to kind, kind of... Uh, operate within different perspectives rather than kind of narrowing things down. They want to have a broader perspective and more options to understand the world in a better way. So in a sense, they're even more impersonal than betas because betas are so, they stick to ideal ideology so much that they're biased. For an ILE, it might not be that much because again, they don't give a fuck about the stupid ideologies of, of betas. So then we get, uh, let's get to it. Then we have role SC. So they might know they're kind of undisciplined and slack enough so they kind kind of might want to change that, but in the end, the effort is kind of fucking useless. So it's a role element. It's not completely dog shit, okay? Many ILEs can show SE because it's role, but they don't value it, and it's probably gonna come out in in ways where it's not very controlled anyway. So who gives a fuck about the role function anyway? Element? Who gives gives a shit? It's the most boring fucking element. I hate talking about it, dude. Anyway, yeah, so then we have Polar, right? And this is interesting. So the ILEs have very out-of-sight, out-of-mind mentality. Maintaining relationships on personal sentiment is very difficult. They're the type of people... I mean, I've seen... I've seen Habibi analyze people. Analyze people, may, may, may kind of... Pay, uh, analyze them based on different behavioral patterns he's, he's seen and... Uh, um, make judgments about them that contain some things that people would consider negative and I've seen people spurg I've seen people actually get angry even though in my opinion like he in my from what I've seen he was just stating how it was and kind of describing the situation I, I to me it seemed impersonal to the person it seemed like an attack on the person's character and and he was fucking confused he, you think he, he understood it He's like what the fuck makes no sense it's not that deep. So this is a good example of that. To them, it's not that deep, okay? They, they can argue different points without getting attached. And to things, things are per, impersonal. 
So struggle with maintaining relationships and, and connecting with people on that kind of sentimental uh, way, you know, so that's definitely going to be a struggle. Not really knowing what they like or don't like, on, on a, again, on a personal level of feelings, uh, how, how people might feel about them. Uh, they they kind of can be clueless, okay, in, in, in that way. So then we have uh, SI Suggestive. So they need a mummy, basically. They need a fucking mummy, aka a CI. Because they're so focused on oh, doing in, in, engaging the mental uh, framework. There's such a mental type, <laughs> and I don't mean mentally like crazy, but again, there's such a head type in a sense that they're always busy thinking, creating shit, focusing on, on things that are more mental, okay, psychological. So there is gonna, they're gonna be uh, slacking off in the physical department, so they might need help in, in, in taking care of themselves, like making sure that they fucking eat, actually, and don't die fucking starving, making sure that they can take care of themselves in, uh, when it comes to their comfort level, their energy level, because they can be so focused on the NE and the TI that they kind of start slacking off with the SI. But they still value, they still value the fact that you are able to produce those results, that you're able to produce their uh, fucking comfort for them. So there is value in it, okay? Uh, so yeah, so basically the scientific geek um, who fucking doesn't eat or maybe is confused, uh, like he, you know, like doesn't take care of himself in that sense as much. And he needs and mommy to fuck help him. Oh, man, yeah. You know what's funny? I at least won't give a fuck. Like, they won't give a fuck. At least watching this, I'm saying, like, they need a mommy. You think they're gonna give a fuck? If I pull it. No fucks given. But no, they don't need a mommy. They need a fucking SEI, okay? So then we have mobilizing. And mobilizing is gonna be FE. And, um, in them, it's it's gonna be fun loving, very fun loving element uh, who, that wants to engage with people emotionally, go with the emotional uh, atmosphere of the group. It act it, it gets activated in a group. And uh, what else? On their own, they can be quite unemotional people. Remember, they can be quite indifferent. But when activated, um, it it gets it gets feisty. So mobilizing it can be bold. So some of them can be very expressive when engage when engaging emotionally. Some of them, not so much. Um, there's this trollish quality to them, right? There's this kind of trollish poking at people emotionally, trying to get reactions, trying to make things fun, because Alpha Quadra again trying to keep things lighthearted, funny, memeing, all of that shit. They wanna they wanna stir the pot, uh, to kind of say that like that so that's that's it and then we got uh, and i ignoring and obviously and i ignoring they're so focused on different perspective as i said and having a broader perspective rather than sticking to a singular path that they don't really care about and i as much okay um i've seen many of them just kind of cringe at and i almost it's very interesting and i've seen uh, also i've seen I at least talk about the future and how things might look in the future and I was kind of wondering about that because I've seen that from them and I was wondering why how the fuck they have NI ignoring so obviously that means it's not really limited to NI maybe it's also any trying to spot different patterns of how things might be who knows so kind of that's they kind of ignore NI they're not really focused on it at all fuck NI that's how they NI is like the child that they are beaten you know the child that is misbehaving and you beat it that's the fucking NI. That is what the ILE does. Psychologically beat the fuck out of the kid. Um, then we have TE uh, demo. And this is going to be interesting. The way it's going to manifest. And I can, I'm can i going to give a good fucking example. They're, they can be quite realistic and, and pragmatic and uh, people, right? But that kind of shows itself when, for example, they have an idea. They're making an, an innovative idea, maybe observation about thing, and they're able to not only make things lo logically consistent, they're also able to remove the stupid useless noise and the useless details that don't really help you understand the topic. So they, they, they almost cut things in pieces and make sure they're simplified to the point where you can understand them. And that is, that is, in my opinion, from what I've seen, how TE demo manifests in them. They can create those ideas, and it can seem so scattered, but but they will kind of take what you need. They can, very, very simple, 
explanations, simplifying things, simplifying concepts rather than making them super complex while still being logically consistent and having sound logic. And that's basically it. So this was, okay, before I end the video, um, ILEs tend to be sevens. In, F, in fact, nearly all ILEs I've ever met were sevens. Some some um, argue also five is possible, like Einstein being ILE five, that, that is what they claim. But that's the anagram type that it might be uh, possible with ILEs. Uh, so that's it for today, guys. Um, might record something more, maybe ESI next time. We'll see. Cheers, ILEs. Cheers.